Thank you, Ted. Well, January is National Glaucoma Awareness Month. As the leading cause of blindness, experts consider it the silent thief of sight. Because of the symptoms, basically they can creep up on you. But there's promising new treatments for the eye disease. Now think of the optic nerve as a cable that connects your brain to your eyes. If that signal is disrupted, it can cause vision loss. Trouble is, in early stages, glaucoma is very subtle. Most people aren't even aware they're losing their vision. By the time it's diagnosed, the vision loss is permanent and there's no cure. Dr. Jeanette Lee with Shepherd Eye Center says lowering pressure in the eye is critical to slowing down the vision loss. We can also do that with laser. So selective laser trabeculoplasty, or SLT, is a commonly performed procedure to lower the eye pressure. And this works well for people who have trouble putting in their drops. Maybe if you have arthritis and it's really hard for you to put in the drops, or just for you, hard for you to remember to put in drops multiple times a day. And finally, we have surgical treatments for glaucoma. Um, surgical treatments of glaucoma um, have become a very exciting field in the last couple of years. Um, there are now a lot of um, surgeries available to treat glaucoma that have less complications and better recovery the time than traditional glaucoma surgeries. Well, it's estimated that more than 3 million people in the country have glaucoma, and half of those don't even know they have it. People who are at higher risk of, of getting glaucoma, including are those people with family history that are of African, Hispanic, or Asian heritage. So even if you have no symptoms or risk eye factors, you should still get the baseline eye exam at 40.